This video is for informational purposes only. There are risks to jailbreaking your iDevice and it does void your Apple warranty. So think before you act. Hey guys, Matt here from todaysiphone.com and this week I'm actually stepping away from showing off a tweak, an application, or some type of theme. And I want to tell you guys about the current uh, SHSH blob situation. Now, if you are unaware of what SHSH blobs are, they basically allow you to downgrade from a current firmware to an older one. For instance, if you're on iOS 5 Beta 2, you could downgrade to iOS 4.33 or 4.28 for that matter, as long as you have your SHSH blob saved. Um, however, with iOS 5's official release, uh, Apple is no longer using the AP ticket, uh, the same which was basically your SHSH blobs, so you can no longer downgrade from iOS 5 to iOS 4. That's official all across the board. The minute you have the official release of iOS 5 on your device, you can no longer downgrade. However, with that being said, if you have an iPhone 4S or an iPad 2, you may no longer have a jailbreak as of this time uh, unless you're on a pre-build of iOS 5. Solely because these two devices have not had a jailbreak released yet uh, that is compatible with the official release of iOS 5. Now, I will keep you guys up to date as soon as a uh, release is announced. That's why I'm telling you now. Please follow me on Twitter at Homemade Geek. As uh, that's where I will instantly post if I find out anything about a jailbreak or any type of news that comes in about the jailbreak situation because just like you, I missed my jailbreak. I accidentally, uh, unknowingly updated to iOS 5 um, thinking that you know the jailbreak would still work, the one that had worked in all the pre-builds or the betas, and I, I found out it doesn't. So uh, hopefully you heed this as a warning and you don't upgrade your device if you have a jailbreak or Whatever your situation is, if uh, you're looking to stay untethered, you're going to need to stay on uh, iOS 4. Uh, and if you're in the betas, you have to make the decision whether you want uh, the official release, you're going to stay with a tethered jailbreak, or you want to drop back, back down to iOS 4. Uh, but take this as a warning again, guys. Thank you for watching. I am sorry about uh, this week not having a tweak or an application to show you, but I wanted to take this time out to actually alert you guys before you get mad because you didn't know. Thank you guys for your time. You guys have a great day. And as always, peace.